Hello, this is Scripture with Bob. Good to be with you again, and we've had a real interesting time in uh, Genesis chapter 10. There's uh, many, many interesting things to discuss and to think about and study in chapter 10. So uh, we're going to be breaking it down over the next few uh, times, and I'm going to do uh, chapter 10 verses 1 through 5 today, and then we're going to talk about uh, some details in that section. So here we go. Now this is the genealogy of the sons of Noah, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. And sons were born to them after the flood. The sons of Japheth were Gomer, Magog, Madai, Javan, Tubal, Tubal, Meshach, and Tyrus. The sons of Gomer were Ashkenaz, Riphath, and Togarma. The sons of Javan were Elisha, Tarshish, Kittim, and Dodanim. From these the coastland peoples of the Gentiles were separated into their lands, every one according to his language, according to their families, into their nations. That's the end of verse 5. Now, first of all, I want you to notice the Bible says that all these people are Gentiles. There are no Hebrews or Jewish people at this time. These are all Gentile people. So now we'll go into some detail with um, some of the names. Uh, we have um, Japheth. The son of Noah is Japheth. And um, this is uh, the the uh, area of the world uh, where these people went after the flood. They, uh, the sons of Japheth by the country were the Scythians, the Slavs, the Croatian people, and Magog. Now, the area in today's world is uh, uh, the area of Japheth is the north and west regions of the earth, such as well, okay, I've got I, I've got it written uh, twice here, but it's the northwest regions of the earth. In other words, it would be Russia, some of those areas up in the north, and and those um, are mentioned at various places throughout the uh, scripture. Um, but this particularly mentions the Russians and the Gauls. Now, the Gauls are from um, uh, France. And uh, so this is where they said uh, these people, some of these people went. Now, uh, another son is a, where the, the sons of Madai, the sons of Madai went to India, Arabia, and and they were uh, went to the, where they say the Medes. Well, the the Medes are in the area of Persia, and then they mention Persia and Afghanistan, and the Kurds would be Kurdistan, and um, so today it would be the Medes and the Persians, Kurds. The Indians, people from India, mostly ironic people, uh, such as Iran, Iraq, Afghanistan, and so forth. Uh, then we have the sons of Javan. The sons of Javan uh, went uh, into the areas such as Greek, Roman, uh, French, Spanish, Portuguese, and Italian, and uh, that would be the seaport areas of the Mediterranean. If you look at your map, uh, the Mediterranean Sea 
and all the nations that have frontage on the Mediterranean Sea. This would many of many of these nations and of these areas were in the uh, the uh, seaport areas of the Mediterranean, and uh, of course that included I mentioned uh, Greek, Roman, French, Spain, Italy, and um, uh, Portuguese. And then um, the last one here we have today is the sons of Tyrus. Um, and uh, they went uh, into the area of the Thracians, the Teutons, the Germans, the Scandinavians, the Anglo-Saxons, and the Jews. Now, um, that would be um, uh, Thrace. Um, would be the area around Germany, and it included Germany, and this also included Scandinavia, and uh, then of course the English, the Anglo-Saxon area, um, uh, Scotland, Ireland, England, uh, that area. So um, thank you for bearing with me today, a uh, little bit tough. Uh, to get some of this uh, written down the way I wanted to say it. But thank you so much. We'll do some more study, and we'll meet you next time. Have a good day.